Welcome everybody to another edition of Lounge Academy. This is the disembodied voice of Howard, one of your hosts, and uh, we're looking at Ryan Lysars, president of WBIG TV. Welcome everybody. Thank you for joining us. Here we are. I'll check the audio. Hello. <laughs> we could see Bar Barbara Fisher. Barbara Fisher is out there. This is great. I love it when Barbara Fisher helps oh. us launch the show. It gives yes, me a lot. It's, it's always good to see. Gives me Barbara a lot Fisher. of confidence. Hello, Barbara Fisher. She's a Lounge Academy stalwart. Yes. Big part of Lounge Academy. Much appreciated. And there's Mary working, working the other, the crowd over there. The bleachers, the bleachers are full. And uh, okay. Well, we we got off. We're here. In case you're wondering, in case you're new to Lounge Academy, and you haven't been following along weekly for the last 12 years. Um, this is Lounge Academy, and that makes you a lounge cadet. And me, I'm, I'm this guy right here. Here's a cameo appearance. Thank you for joining us. And this is, uh, our, uh, along with the hosts, Ryan Lysars and myself, is uh, Mary, the better half, Mary Clunz Goldman, on, on uh, our left and your left at home. And, and this is Brenda. Brenda's the one everybody really wants to see because she's in, she's uh, responsible for here at Reality Piano Bar, which is what what this is, by the way. Um, Brenda's responsible for most of the creative writing on the show. Although being being Reality Piano Bar, um, it writes itself around Brenda's uh, jet set lifestyle. <laughs> So, uh, <laughs> well, you can see, I mean, she's a natural, isn't she? Look at that. <laughs> Just got my hair cut today. Looks, looks wonderful. Great. Wow, yeah. beautiful. Just got a cut. Got rid of the long hair. Oh, well, I, whatever you did, I like it. Thank you. Yeah, I got, I skipped my trim this week. <laughs> I did it last week. I'm on the COVID haircut plan. <laughs> I started cutting my hair during COVID lockdown, like everybody. And uh, not Ryan, though. Not you can me. tell he's got the $300 haircut. <laughs> Definitely not. <laughs> and uh, I, I, you know, I'm kind of a do-it-yourselfer <laughs> with everything. That's great. You know, if my transmission breaks, I'll fix it. If I need a haircut, I'm, I'm happy to be able to uh, have the... the the means and know-how. I inherited a dog clipper. It's actually a sheep clipper that my uncle used for his dog, his little wire-haired terrier, back in the 1980s. And it's made by... Uh, is it Oster? Oster. Very good. Yeah, Oster, which is I, like a premium brand of hair clipper. For blenders as well. Is that the same company? Yes. It's this thing, this Oster hair clipper I have is extremely well built, it's and like it includes Bakelite. It's like taking what to my a head? Blender. A blender, yes, <laughs> a liquefier. <laughs> now it looks like you guys beat me to the bar. Yeah. We did. We did. Because yeah. we we can't delay. So we don't have to do to the bar segment. There's nobody down there. So yeah. did oh, you see the sign on the bar? I that. did see the sign. I didn't remember saying it last week. Lounge, it says Lounge Academy. You guys, we've all made it to yes. this. Yeah. This yes. is a big time. It was so nice of them to make those signs for us. <laughs> it was. You can see we got some beautiful views, some vistas. Um, could dial in the. There we go. Look at the, look at that. Beautiful scenery. It just. The Gold Dome Savings Bank, M and T, and the Steps to Success, and the White House. We've got Main Street, 
right out here the train goes by every every now and then and down here we've got a Starbucks for the teetotalers oh there goes the metro rail Gotta get there it metro. goes and uh, that guy gave us the thumbs up again from the train he flipped it right up there really yeah pretty sure it was his thumb <laughs> Last night at, um, at the uh, let's see the, the meetup dinner in Tonawanda. What was the name of that? Canal Club, Canal Club 60, 62. 62. And I invited them to come tonight. Oh, well, so. see, she is the operator. <laughs> 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 Wonderful. Looking so, forward to, to meeting. Yeah, they were, they were excited. The, a couple. You invited a couple, the couple. Yeah, Donna wow. and, and her Branching out. We'll see. Out. Can't wait to see who they are. She's a lot of fun. Are they kids? Like just newlyweds? Like just like out of college? Yeah. Like our age. Good. Good. Our age. Our age. That was safe. So we'll have something. In, <laughs> we'll have something in common. Yeah. They're mature adults. Yes. Mature like adults. like us. We're looking for fun. In all the wrong places. <laughs> Well, um, I guess we're not going to do the bar walk. Do you really want to? <laughs> we we could just to uh, just to chew up like the, you know the first part of the segment. Let's see if there's any comments. Uh, Dale Pine saying hello. How are you, Dale? Great to see you, my old friend. Our own Andrea is is uh, with us tonight as well, uh, virtually. <laughs> As long as she's with us, yeah, then it's wonderful. Well, if you want to go downstairs, we should we check go. out the bar? I'll stay here and guard the piano. Okay, okay. we're gonna <laughs> split up. This week okay. is a little bit different because, um, you know, last week we had the uh, the basketball games were going on during the first part of the show. Today they won't be starting until it's quieter. There's Marina. Seven o'clock. Oh, they, they're still going on. Yes. I mean, not in Buffalo. It's, oh. I meant on the TVs. Okay, because last week it was March Madness right here. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury. Oh, look, the bar is filled in. Now, we've got some storylines mm -hmm. creating themselves for us, and that's uh, our very own uh, Gary, Gary Marino is here. And uh, he's he's a he's a co-host of the show of Lounge Academy. <laughs> it's for um, Lounge Academy. It, there's a little uh, marketing thing there for you. It might it might be your bag. Starting a tab. <laughs> this is the first time our market is working over here. I got it now. Oh, it's been a resting day from last week. Everybody, good. Everyone wants to see Nat. <laughs> Oh, great, great. Thank Wonderful. You. Thank you very much. You're welcome. We're just going to head up top. Have a good time. Thank you. See that? What happened? See, they saw our new marketing material. I saw that. And yeah. they're running up the escalators. Wow. They're not even, they're they're running up them. Yeah. <laughs> well, now you know what that yes. means, Howard. It means we got to start. means you have to play. It means Marino's going to have to make friends with those people <laughs> so yeah. that they feel, they're, they know they're in the, the hip place. What's up, Marino? Just admiring the view, the atrium, the American flag. It is amazing, isn't it? Yeah, it's a nice place. Let me go for a ride. Marino is now riding the brass escalator. Whee!
Nice to see you, Jay Anderson, the bow tie fellow. Oh, that's that's uh, president of WBIG TV, Ryan Lysars. Oh, this is great, great. <laughs> Wonderful. I thought you were going to say See, the signage is working. I will now switch switch you over to the to the multicam situation. Okay, we are now on the studio mic. Right, Ryan? Great. Ryan Lysars. And uh, we, didn't, we didn't get to like chew up too much of the clock. We usually count on that, you know? Well, you'll notice there's a new, a new piece of gear. Oh, here. Is that picking up the around the piano? Well, that's, that's, that's what, what it's for. for. And uh, every week is an experiment in not only music and culture, but in technology. So you could, you know, you could take your pick. Okay, the cameras are switching. Faces of 1952. What was the name of that show? It was a show, New Faces of, and then a year. You don't know the New Faces one? Yeah, that was, I'm not making it up. It was an actual. Maybe somebody at home can look it up. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's all right, right though. Most, 
Well, now we've got some real celebrities here to join more celebrities. Welcome back to Mount Academy. Do you know where everything is? Help yourself. McNeil is here. She's known to the world. It's just McNeil, just like Cher and Elvis. Ladies and gentlemen. 
and gentlemen, Dave Wendy is in the house. He's a big actor here down in the theater district and, and beyond. Nice to see you, Mr. Wendy. Fresh tuna, right from the key. Don't we'll let the crocodiles smell that, they'll be all over it. Shout out to show business legend Gary Mooney, one of the best known clowns in the business. Thank you. 
microphone up. Welcome to Lounge Academy. So I see you know, you know Brenda. Brenda knows all the hot spots to go to. Got a picture of your cat. Oh, she's so sweet. What a beautiful cat. I fell in love as soon as I saw that picture. Speaking of show business. Nobody's paying attention to me, which is the whole, the whole purpose of this type of uh, 
activity. Something table. Something new, guys. To spring. Is it officially spring? Yeah. Well, that's great. That's that's a that's something. It's a step. one of the parties where they never meant it to be a friendship from the beginning and were feigning friendship and just, you know, just not even going for romance. It was my first two marriages. Wow, so you walked the walk. No, that was my first one. Not so much my second. Now, were you the one feigning? Were you the one with fraudulent intent? Our informal survey here at Lounge Academy. This is the end of a beautiful friendship.
was taken as a proposal, and here we are. Yeah. Yeah. Music can be dangerous. Gotta handle every song like it's a loaded pistol. Careful who you aim it at. So it must have been a pretty good one. I should have known this song had their um, signature scale pattern in the melody. That's a little trick to know Rogers and Hart songs. They they sneak a little scale in there. Just a regular diatonic scale. Where is it in here? Here it is. People fly. trick in the trade. Patrick is bringing some great stuff for us here at Lounge Academy. Thank you, Patrick Murphy. Notice how he did that? Another big round of applause for Pat for making it so great up here for us. And, and Nat, he, Nat's really the one. We'll give Pat the credit. Welcome to Lounge Academy. Make yourself, that's your seat. Start. The party started. 
It's Donna. talking to Angela. It's all language. It's all the same. Angela's writing songs of love. Kidding. Bobby McFerrin. Oh, that must have been great. And what I swear they practiced on the limousine over there. They just jammed all night. So, so Chick would play a, a riff and Bobby would sing a riff. Yeah, right. And I was like, like well, you're really good. Yeah, like, it's really cool. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's great to know that they have to fake it too. Sounds great. Now, did you encounter uh, Ari Silverstein while you were in New York? No, not that time. Oh, I thought this happened like this week. your job. Mrs. Berg. They're writing songs of love, but not for Mrs. Berg. <laughs> A lucky star above, but not for me. Love to lead the way. I found warm clouds of gray than any Russian play could guarantee. I was a 
business. She's in the style book that you call her McNeil. In the Buffalo News, they called you McNeil. That's how that got started. Like Cher or Elvis. She is. The couple. The, the, the handsome show business couple. The pandemic. The pandemic. I never got it. Did you? Oh, yeah. Did you get it? Together, where 
weather-wise, it's such a lovely day. Say the word, we'll meet the bird. Acapulco Bay. It's perfect for flying honeymoon. They say, come fly with me. Apologies to Jimmy Van Heusen and Sammy Kahn. <laughs> they wrote it. Dave, hey, you know what I'm going to do? Um, I'm going I'm to thank the makers of uh, Pure Pure Aqua Bellvia for um, providing the, the, some of the beverages here at Lounge Academy. And um, this goes right into the official Lounge Academy mug. I haven't seen this in a few years. Yeah, isn't it something? No. Yeah. A picture from Facebook popped up of you and me and Mary. Ten years ago. Listening to Jocko. Here. Oh, that's it was just like yeah, a few like like weeks ago. It just popped up. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't it amazing how time goes by? Actually, you must remember this. could figure it out. Yeah. You're watching Lounge Academy on WBIG TV. It's our fake TV network. It's also known as my Facebook profile. Soak it in a pail of water before we open it. Can you just see this jacket on that 
It's going to be perfect. Be perfect. I like it a lot. Thank you. I do. I do too. Living in the best. I'm lucky so much. How's his health? Well, at least for, at least for, at least for now. I hope it's an Amvex bag. Oh, it's a tissue. How fancy. It's a tissue. And it's a lot of his showers. It's a hard bag. It's a regular mother. Oh, right, right. Yes. And you just don't get that kind of service anymore. No. Oh. Oh. Dr. Who takes care of everybody. Oh. 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 I mean, when, when somebody gets a tie, they always like pretend they like it, you know? Well, you know, I, I know hate it, it, but I mean, I really do like it. Where's Lawrence going to see? He sold Mexico, and he was in... The ads of me liking that tie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Now, it's you guys. Yeah, you look to be in all nice for life. Notice we got two mics open. That's not good. How did that happen? He says he doesn't like her. She shows up like two hours later in the day. You guys have probably been hearing an echo, right? Have you guys been hearing an echo? We had two mics open. It usually causes an echo. Let's check here. One mic, one mic, one mic. One mic. One mic. the unwitting accomplices.
when you get back on your feet again. Everybody wants to be your long lost friend. I said it straight without any doubt. Nobody knows you. Nobody knows you. Nobody knows you. That's good, Melissa. I'm glad to hear that because usually, usually that's a, a grievous mistake when there's two mics on. Ladies and gentlemen, I just play the piano and sing and tell great jokes and pour my guts out to the world, expose myself. But God is in the room. Alex Leonard, ladies and gentlemen. Alex Leonard's out there in the audience, not in the lounge, the virtual lounge. Right off a big show he did that I, I caught part of it on Facebook today. What a, what a great show that was, Alex. He had a rhythm section with him. Produced. 
he did. And it didn't matter of speaking, the, the re-release. Oh, day in and day out. days begin when I awake I awaken with a tingle one possibility in view that possibility may be seeing you in the rain go and shine I meet you and to me the day is fine then you kiss your lips Oceans roar, thousand drums. Can't you see it's love? There can be any doubt when there is day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out. A little something from the Lake Wow album. Thank you. Got a great group here from St. Anthony's. There's nothing like a St. Anthony's audience. If they could sit on those wooden pews for five hours at a shot, they could do this with sleeping. I'll see what I, yeah, I'll see what I got with me though. If I have it with me, I can. Otherwise, we're going to do it next time for you. Thank you. If I don't see her each day, I miss her. Nancy with the laughing face guy you know he, I understand he, he like wrote the whole song himself words lyrics the music to do it all himself while he was living a one percenter lifestyle the guy was a big socialite so they tell me whatever that is glimpse of stocking was looked on as something shocking. Now heaven knows anything goes. Good authors who once knew better words now only use four letter words writing prose. Anything goes, the world is mad today, and what's bad today, light today, and what's night today, when most guys today, a woman cries today, so we jiggle woes. Though I'm not a great romancer, I know that you're bound to answer when I propose anything It's bad. 
today. Most guys today, that women rise today. They're just silly gigolos. And though I'm not a great romancer, I know that you're bound to answer when I propose anything goes Ooh, anything Great request. One of the best songs. Thank you. That went out to St. Anthony. It's going to help me find the key. Hi, Rebecca. I'm good. Welcome. Oh, my goodness. Well, thank you. Wonderful meeting you. some hamburgers now. Five on Lounge Academy. I was hoping somebody would order those. I wanted to see what they look like. Would you like one? Uh, no, I, I do, but I, you know, I'll make a big mess out of everything. I'll eat your leftovers when I'm done playing. I should have brought my dog bowl. That was for Edmund Harmonsky. Haremsky, my neighbor. Great guy. My favorite photographer, John Dutkovich. Something took over. Yeah. You know, that, that stuff works. Mary's got a handle on that. If I ever lose anything, Mary's got... She's got people. She's got saints. What, what's Francis? 
When, 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 do, when do we call? When do we speed dial him? Yeah, Mary's got him on speed dial. No, there have been things that could not be explained. Lots of them. And I'm not going to explain them either. Because they can't be. I don't doubt anything anymore. I don't believe anything and I don't doubt anything. Alex Leonard might know the song that this is the verse to. I'll be surprised if he does not, but I'm surprised. For some reason, people have a mental block about this, and even, even the songsmiths. Um, I was never spellbound. See if you can name it that tune, uh, Alex Leonard, without Googling it. By a starry sky. What is there to moon glow when love has passed you by? Then there came a midnight. Do you know what this is the verse to? Even Guy Boyer, me? No, Paul Kakoda, every time. I, Stump him every time, and he you can't stump him. And the world was new, here am I, so spellbound, darling, not by stars, but just by you, everybody. At last, my love has come on. My lonely days are over, and my fears like a song. Orchestra Wives. Here's one from the same pair of movies. Why do robins sing in December? Long before the spring. 
springtime is due. And even though it's snowing, violets are growing, I know why, and so do you. Every evening Whispering your name as they do And you're Stars are on my ceiling I know why And so do you I'm in heaven when the music begins. I can see the sun when it's raining, hiding every cloud from my view. When do I see rainbows when you're in my arms I know why and so do you I know why and so do you Thank you. Starship Lounge Academy, beamed right from the atrium in the Hyatt Regency Buffalo. I love saying that name. It sounds so, sounds so fancy. Sometimes I kind of do it. I love that you kind of do this. I know which book that's in. You'll find it. It's the one that's at home. 
Well, maybe we could kind of do it. What key was that in? That's E flat. Let's try it in uh, just to make it challenging. three months. requested in 2019, just getting caught up post-COVID, catching up on the requests. Who remembers this one? to you by Jeremy Barone Spinal Care, Chiropractic Nuka Care. He's around the Chicago area. And he pays me 400 bucks to mention his, his, uh, his practice. And here. So I'll be expecting 400 bucks in my PayPal from my nephew Jeremy. Knowing him, he'll send 800. That's the way he is.
Is that your key, Janice Schlau? G? That's a nice key. I should have known. Janice sings in the key of G. Oh, yeah. Once she even broke her G string. And then she couldn't sing in the key of G anymore. so many people lounging and relaxing in this day and age. This is what we need. We need just to have blank, to blank out like this. Feels good, doesn't it? More than ever, people need a lounge. That's why it's so busy. We all need lounge. Quest for Alex Leonard it's by Peter Allen. You and me, we wanted it all. We wanted it all. Passion without pain. Sunshine without rainy days. We wanted it always. You and me, we reached for the sky. The limit was high. Never giving in. should have seen it in your eyes. Look, look how all our dreams came true. See how I've got me. See how you've got you. Something deep inside You and me We weren't like the rest We once were the best Back when we were dumb How did we become so smart? to break each other's heart. Look, look how all our dreams came true. See how I've got me. See how you've got you. Through it all, just one thing done. A little thing called love. Something deep inside You and me We weren't like the rest We once were the best Look what we've become Isn't it a crying shame That we almost made it, but we wanted it all. Baby, you and me, we wanted 
St. Anthony for bringing us some great guests tonight. Thank you so much. Ooh, thank you. And we'll hit the spot later on. A slider. Brenda, I like your friends. Really nice. Usually she brings a bunch of hippies in here. Brenda. These are like respectable people. Thank you all, we love you. There they go. Wonderful guests tonight. The type of guests we get here at the Hyatt Regency, Buffalo, Day Bundy, here at Lounge Academy. You can't get more downtown than like where we're sitting, right? Nick. <laughs> it's Nick, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, Nick. <laughs> yeah, you'll never outdo that stunt. And don't try to. to discover from lover to lover how little we understand what touches off that tingle that sudden explosion when two tingles intermingle who cares to define what chemistry this is Karen Lizzie cares with your lips on mine would oh yeah yeah so long as you kiss me and the world around us shatters how little it matters how little we know
shout out to Karen Lizzie, who might be watching from It's Nancy. Can I sit next to you? Yes, I insist. Ask me a simple question because my answer never never ends. Does it make me nervous if these people are watching you? It, it doesn't. It doesn't. It's just funny because not, not too long ago it was terrifying. Really? Yeah. You know they say that um, what the biggest fear is like death and public speaking. I fell into that category, but I don't know, all of a sudden I just didn't, you know, maybe, maybe like I had a stroke or something, I didn't know about it. Do you use I don't Jackie's, care about anything anymore. Do you consult Jackie's notes? Well, I, I consult Jackie almost every moment, yeah. even if I'm not at the piano, but I, I have not started, I'm just kind of like savoring this. So when they get here, but we do an early, we do an early show here. See, they're not all now. They're getting warmed up. You can tell. But when people first come in, they're not in the full like lounge submerging, yet, which is what they need. It's like getting into a hot tub because they need to relax. You know, lounging is more important than it's ever been, maybe in the history of mankind, because we're just inundated with. Things that kind of rattle us all day long. Really the messages were forced on us. Yeah. You know, everybody wants our attention every second to, yeah. to, to enforce, enforce their opinion on us. Thanks for that beautiful. Well, thanks. I didn't explain I'm writing a story, did I? No, but I'm married to a journalist, so I kind of figured that yeah. out. Tape recorder is not a fun thing for you. Uh, I kind of dig recording, so you tell me. Can ring the bell. Even though you didn't misbehave. Well, it's to restore order. It's like a gavel. But the first phase of the night, most people aren't as loose as Nick when they first get here. Nick's, when they let Nick out, he just goes wild. He's going wild. He came in on his head last time. He rode up the escalator on his head. Interesting. Yeah, scared the heck out of us. But he's fine. He's made out of rubber. But the first part, when when I first come in, that's when they're staring at me. See, if you look around, they're not they're not all staring at me. She's. They, they were they were for that moment because that lady over there is staring at you. Because we we were attracting their attention with with you. But. When it first starts out, yeah, they're all staring and they're all stiff. There goes Dave Lundy off to some show business destinations, off to a show. Wonderful to see him. He's looking great. He looks, he looks like he's all ready for a big part where you're just looking like that, looking good like that. You look, you look good. Yeah, I mean, don't take, you know, you know what I mean. Ready for, ready for the movies. More than ever. All that gardening is helping. They bought a big place that takes all kinds of work. McNeil, great seeing you. Thank you. We usually get a, a big show business crowd. I 
and I love it. You know, there's not, no better night than when when you get to entertain the entertainers. That's great. Because they understand the pain of the creative process. Just thinking to yourself, that's a funny joke. That's, that's how funny, I am with Mary. That's a funny joke, and I'm, I'm like finding my other point. Professionals yes. don't laugh because we're like comedy writers. We can't laugh at everything. I can't laugh at everything. But when the night starts and they're all staring at you, that that is the most uncomfortable part of the night. But 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 I I dig it because I know like that's when you want to get your traction, and that's when you're needed the most, and that's when they need me the most because. That's when you're there to break the ice. It's not a concert where they're supposed to watch you. That means that's only allowed to happen in the beginning when they need the ice pro. So you got to be like the what is it, the SS Cutter in the, yeah. the, the Buffalo River? Yeah. You got to be like an icebreaker like that thing. It just occurred to me I got to stop so that you can do your thing. This is my thing. Yes, I was sound white enough. You were sound white Well, thank you. That's a big compliment. I know. Look at that. Everybody's so way too nice to me. You must have me confused with somebody else. You must have me confused with a gas pump. Here's a wonderful Jimmy Van Heusen song with lyrics by Phil Silvers, of all people. We'll do a hard transition there for Bill Jenkins. Nice to see you, Bill Jenkins. Wonderful. Did they have you aboard? David Vernon's out there, too. This, he's with us, David Vernon, one of my favorite singers in the world. Phil Stiller is here. Here's one for David Vernon. If I don't see her each day, I miss her. Gee, what a thrill. Each time I kiss her, believe me. I've got a case That's Nancy with the laughing face She takes a winter And makes it summer Summer for take Some lessons from her. Picture a tomboy in lace. Nancy with the laughing face. Do you ever hear mission bells ringing? Same glow. When she speaks, you would think it would. 
was singing. Hear her say, Come on. I swear to goodness, you can't resist her. Here's the best line of the song right here. Sorry for you. She has no sister. No one could ever resist. That's Nancy with the laughing face. Jimmy Van Heusen and Phil Sobers. That was for Nancy. There she goes. She got her sound bite. She's out of here. Some people say they're going out to catch a bite. If they're a journalist, that's a sound bite. I know, because I married one. We're getting impressionistic. There he is. How are you? Mr. Mayor. <laughs> How are you doing? Great. Nice to see you. Hi, Stephanie. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I saw your name out on Facebook and uh, maybe you'll show up one of these days. She's drinking at the bar downstairs. Is that where she is? I think maybe she's sending people up. We're getting a lot of people. It's like a sideshow, you know. She, she corrals them. What are you doing downtown? What are you doing downtown? Good to see you. Wow. That's so great. Now we are, for sure. As late as you want. turns over. They, people can only stand it so long. <laughs> I remember when I was downstairs when I was living here. You were living here? We moved out. Oh, cool. What a cool place to hang out for. Maybe somebody will find me some signs. We can update them. But then again, they might get canceled. Depends what you put on them. Yeah, right below us. Okay. Right where Barry's elbow is. Holding hands at midnight, neath the starry sky. Nice work if you can get it, and you can get it if you try. Strolling down that one girl, sighing sigh after sigh. Nice work if you can get it, and you can get it if you try. 
Just imagine someone waiting for that cottage door. Two hearts became one. Who can ask for anything more? Love in one, you love you. And then taking that vow. Nice work, you can get it. And you can get it. Won't you tell me how? That was a classic Gershwin song right there. Nice to see you, Mr. Silverstein, lounging with us tonight. song in years, Ari. Got a great group here tonight. Lounge Academy, as you can see at home. It's a star-studded cast. I gotta adjust the, uh, the deal here. I'm going to give you the view of the vista. The, the cadets silhouetted against the beautiful backdrop of the city of Buffalo skyline. The best vantage point for it. What a way to spend a Friday night. We got well the, the cameras, there's different cameras switching. Switching automatically. Right now it's on you. show business couple, Angela and Alan, as they descend the brass, the shiny brass escalator to their next show business destination. Who did, who's Mary? Uh, someone says she's at the bar downstairs. Bring her up. Don't get trapped down there with her. We don't want to lose you. We don't want to lose Mary either.
from north to south, from east to west. You are the love I love the best. You're the dream girl of the sweetest story ever told. A dream I've sought both night and day. For years throughout the USA. Sit down. I think I am. I sing from of the I sing. It was it was a a, a spoof on uh, on political on presidential elections, or so I'm told. I've not seen the movie or the show. That was from well, it was Gershwin. It was from it was from of the I sing, a, a show by the same name, uh, 1931. A little before our time. Oh, just a little, little bit. bit. Yeah, yeah. Not, not that much. Though. We're, you know, we're closer to that than... Closer to the, to the back side than the front side. <laughs> well, yeah. Well, I like that. I love it when we turn the room throughout the night. See, now we're getting the dusk. It's a different crowd. It's a 7.30 crowd instead of a 5 o'clock crowd. Well, you, you go the distance. You're a professional. Yes. Here's when they play on all the telethons. On a clear day. Rise and look around you, and you'll see who, who you are. On that clear day, how it will astound you. I saw that, Kathy. Outshines every star you'll feel part of. Every mountain, sea, and shore 
yet you can hear from far and near a world you've never heard before on that clear day on that clear day you can see forever and ever Simple sounding. Simple sounding is the hardest to achieve. It's very clear. Our love is here to stay. Not for a year, but ever and a day. The radio and the telephone. Passing fancies and in time may go. But oh, my dear, our love is here to stay. Together we're going a long, long way. In time, They're only made of clay. Our love is here to stay. Our love is here to stay. Another great Gershwin song. That one's from the Goldwyn Follies. Did they have, is that the one where they had the Goldwyn Follies of like 1933 and of 1936 and of, they keep redoing it and they have different, it was like a, it was like a car inspection. Probably sounds better far away. That's good. That was Nick. He's singing all the time. Thank you, David Vernon. We're really entertaining the stars tonight.
the night is like a lovely tune. Beware, my foolish heart. How I be ever constant move. Hard to see on an evening such as this. But they both give the very same sensation. At the moment of a kiss. Jocko be now, Melody Leibowitz. We had a question from, from the cadets. Um, I lost track of the math. How, how old was he when we lost him? Around 90? I think he was still playing when he was 88. I think we celebrated his birthday here when he was 88. But Jocko. that uh, musicology, Janice Schlau. Janice is cooking for her restaurant while she's listening. I'm not too bad. It's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. He mums up. It's the only way I could shut him up is to ask him how he likes my haircut. 
you know what I'm going to do, Nick? Tell tell a few jokes. I'm going to I'm going to just take uh, since we're we, you know we're turning the room over, I'm just going to powder my nose, and uh, Nick's going to. I can't play the piano. I could see. How about that? Very little. I sing. Strange day, but true day. When I'm close to you, dear, the stars in the sky what you am I? I, I haven't seen it for four years. I have four, four years. That I'm, I'm taking my place up here. You want to come? You don't have to You know, they got great, great food here at the Hyatt. I'm, I'm sampling some of the menu items here. I knew I'd find like things on the floor. That's your ammo. <laughs> It's mine or yours. It's both of ours. Something we share. Oh, there we go. I, I don't have my job. I got too old. Too old for what? Well, I, that I thought I could. And then I 
See how the cameras look. That's a good one. Let's check the. I can't see. Oh, we oh we got an issue with this one. Good thing we're checking them. See, you were right to check check the cameras. Where's the cam? Oh, no, we want white cam. Okay, white cam is working. That cam is working. This cam is working. This cam is working. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the part of Lounge Academy where the unwitting contestants of reality TV forget about the cameras and the microphones and start getting into the real, the real juicy stuff that good reality TV shows are made out of. We've carefully placed cameras and microphones around the lounge, counting on them to forget about them. You ever wonder on, we watch reality TV shows, let me put the camera on so you can see me. Here we go, this is me. Here we are. No, that's not the right one. Oh, we got these switched. All right. You ever wonder, you know, you watch these reality TV shows, and you wonder, there's no way these people could be behaving like that knowing they're on camera. But from doing a Lounge Academy a reality piano bar, I've learned that there, there is a, a phenomenon of human nature. If you keep the cameras on long enough, people, somehow they, they I know it seems impossible, but it must be like some form of hypnotism or something. They, they forget the cameras are there or they just don't, they're looking at the camera and they don't think it's there. And they really let their hair down. And this is where the good plot lines form. And, and these lounge cadets, I mean, you, you could not write a script as good as what naturally unfolds in their lives. And the only reason I'm explaining this to you, not only for artistic expression and for the understanding of the type of cinema that we're creating here, but because so I but so I can buy time to eat this cheeseburger that somebody gave me. That's a real reason. But that's part of the sausage making show business is you got to refuel after two and a half hours. Janice Schlau could testify to that because she understands food and she's seen a lot of people eat. She watches people eat every day. I'm going to give you back the rotating. Actually, they're not rotating cameras. They're um. You got the um, heaters back right now. That's that's not a great camera at all. It's also not ideal for the microphone itself. Oh, there's bacon on this or something. Something. Something good. Now, as this cheeseburger gets down to be like a like the end of a good
good cigar. I can successfully wield it with one hand and start playing some chords in the right hand. what to do with this camera angle of uh, Peter Peter's back here. We could switch it to make it more of a vista. Because I think the vista, downtown Buffalo Vista shot, is important. Okay. Sammy Khan, a couple of songwriter ringers. It's called All My Tomorrows. Started singing. Oh, well, you got lost in it. It's great. Today, I may not have a thing at all, except for just a dream or two. I've got lots of plans for tomorrow. All my tomorrow. Right now, it may not seem like spring at all. We're drifting and the laughs are few. 
I've got rainbows planned for tomorrow All my tomorrow belong to you No one knows better than I that I keep passing me by that's fate but with you there by my side I'll still be turning the tide just wait
the wrong is right till the birds refuse to sing beyond the ears, the echo of my own love will still be whispering Happy 
to be near you when you need someone to cheer you all the way Tower than the tallest tree that's how it's got to feel That's how deep it goes, if it's real. When somebody needs you, it's no good unless she needs you. straight home or are you going to go to some gin mills on the way home? Yeah, I would. I 
watching Lounge Academy. This is the epilogue of Lounge Academy. You can watch every week at 5 o'clock Eastern Time. New York Time, for those of you overseas that might be struggling to figure out exactly what we're on. fingers. of tonight. tonight. <laughs> that one, I, I, I don't have the score for it with me. That's a great um, Michelle Legrand tune. Yeah, I need, the, I need the score for that one to, to do it justice, to, to not do it justice. Oh, that's great. What a great song. One of the most beautiful songs. She'll wear her gown, and I wear my tuxedo, and you can play that for us. We'll do that. 
This was our wedding song. I say I'll move the mountains and I'll move the mountains as she wants it so shall it be crazy she calls me sure i'm crazy crazy in love let's say Sigmund and Bob Russell. What's that? I'm not that familiar with their work. Uh, Carl Sigmund and Bob Russell, but you can't write a song like that without having a bunch of them in you now. It's too, too much craft. Tony Kunz to the room, the maestro. Also happens to be Mary's brother, as we all know. Everyone knows Tony. Wonderful for me, Peter. Came all the way down We've been waiting for the We've been trying to get down here for quite a while. We'll be down again. I'm starving to death now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I've been there. And when my bride is Luckily, started. somebody gave me a slider, so I'm okay. <laughs> Otherwise, by now, my gas tank is empty. So where are you going to go eat? I don't know where we're going to go. Who's got a good fish fry close by? Is there, is there a fish fry nearby? What about the flaming fish right over there? It's got an open sign. You can walk right out in there. How is that place? Well, I, I think it's good. I think they send people over there quite a bit. Really? So. Well, that, that could be. 
I mean, they probably have fish there. I mean, you'll be eating like in, in a few minutes. There we go. I mean, it's got the propinquity hey, thing going for it. We park the car. You're all yeah. We don't have to move. Just don't get don't trip on the tracks or get hit by a train. You'll be fine. I've been known to do that. Well, it happens. <laughs> it's a trip hazard. I can't get used to that. I always uh, feel like I'm breaking some, some rule, like I'm gonna get yelled at. Yeah, yeah, it's just, right, everything tells you, just right. use a different route. And then how do you park? You know, people seem to be savvy and know how to do it. It's like, it's like parking on another planet. It's yeah. got these posts and different right. things that I'm just not. That's right. Well, hey, why don't we try that? Let's yeah, let us know how it is. You haven't been there yet. No, I haven't. But this is not a recommendation by you. Well, only because um, they said they do. Yeah. Okay. We will tell you next time we're here. We will tell you how it is. We'll be looking forward to your your Janice Oaken like friends. review. We had some friends that pinked out on us today. Well, they they lost out big they time. Did. Without a doubt. N now they're going to miss out on the flying fish just to top it off. How are good to see you. Nice to see you, Peter. Really, thank you very much for the beautiful music. Well, well, we'll be thank back. Thank you so much. You know, I love Mary. We've been through quite a bit musically. I, I know it. It was a lot of fun. Frustrating at times. I miss I miss seeing you on her beat. Yeah. <laughs> it used to be fun. To come out to see That's her. right. You still do the stuff at Nichols? Stephanie is working at Nichols. Not me. I'm, I'm still buying stock and selling stock and uh, oh. still, you know, I'm with Wells Fargo. So for me, and oh, you, I blasted oh, you're, you're a trader for Wells. I'm working from home. I see. It I'm wants a, to go back. I'm the hedge fund manager for uh, Amalgamated Equities. There you go. That's our retirement account. There we go. Amalgamated Equities. If you need some to put in the orders, <laughs> yeah, who needs a Meritrade when I could, I, could te I could text you? That's right. Text me anytime. I'm in front of my computer all day. <clears throat> you know, it's funny. What, what, a, what, what a couple of weeks we've had. I'm sorry? What a couple oh, yeah. of weeks, the Mark thing. Hey, it's listen, wow. opportunities abound. As long as, you know, you're short term, not for long term stuff. We'll see what happens. It's fun. Okay, listen. I've Call me for, when the uh, I've been in for debt market's going to melt down. <laughs> Give me a heads up, after, day before. After 42 years, we've been through a lot. Good to see you. Thank you very much for a beautiful evening. Well, thank you. you for, thanks for making it one. And I just, we will find, we will, you have to ask about that, about the signs. It must be in a, some closet somewhere. The signs? Yeah. I love you. Oh. Welcome. You're beautiful. Well, a lot of that stuff, um, Dave Granville um, took, had had his music put in the Buff State Library. Really? Like, like as a you know as a collection, you know, oh, to wow. preserve it. He, he did that. And it's probably I didn't ask him, but that paddle is probably there. Yeah, probably you're right. Now I I did research on that paddle, and it was an actual product that it was derived from. Some somebody had bought it for him. And it, it was called a sign paddle or something. And they're, they're, they're on eBay once in a while, the, in their original original uh, form. You know, and uh, I think people would use it when they're driving or yeah, something. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Like, and then, you know, and screw then, you. And then he added a few <laughs> to them. And that's uh, right. put a lot of tape around. That thing must have been really old. It was very funny. So was I've, very got, funny. I've got some pictures of it. So yeah. I mean, Do you really? Yeah, I don't very, have, I don't have every, funny. I didn't flip through and take every, uh, yeah. I should have. It was very funny. I mean, it's no big deal. I'm just, I, you know, I just remember that. Because I know, but that is a great the impact uh, on my daughter. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Good to see we'll you. get a frat paddle instead. There we That'll have a real impact on people. All right. <laughs> That's all we meet again. Very good. Looking forward to it. Enjoy the, the fish. Well, thank you, everybody. Uh, I think we're going to call it quits here before we turn the room again. And uh, quit while we're ahead here. We had a great night. Really enjoyed it. And uh, 
we'll kill the stream now and start uh, start packing up and look forward to uh, doing this again uh, next week. And uh, please join us again here at Lounge Academy on WBIG TV, right on my Facebook wall. And on, on YouTube, the reruns are at a YouTube channel called WBIG.TV. Good night, everyone. Good night, Janice. Good night, Tom Marino. See you out there. Have a great night.